Good morning and thank you for starting your Friday with Denver 7 News. I'm Nicole Brady and I'm Brian Sanders. Here are your top stories for Friday. State health officials say they are cautiously optimistic. Colorado's Omicron surge has peaked. The state reported more than 15,000 new cases yesterday. And while that number is high, officials say the numbers are trending down. Hospitalizations also remain high. 93% of available ICU beds are in use. The Boulder County Disaster Assistance Center is closing this weekend. The center opened for Marshall Fire victims earlier this month with federal, state and county resources. The federal and state resources like FEMA will stay in the building in Lafayette. County resources are moving online tomorrow night. The website is boco.org slash Marshall Fire. County officials stress that no services are going away. If you prefer in person, you'll need to go to the Disaster Center today or tomorrow because they'll move online Sunday. The Winter X Games kick off in Aspen this morning. This is the 25th year for the X Games and the 21st year for Aspen to host. Last year, no fans were allowed because of COVID, but this year vaccinated fans are welcome and there will be a lot to see in person and on TV. Tickets to X Games events are free. You can learn more on the X Games website. Here's meteorologist Lisa Hidalgo with your Denver 7 weather action day forecast. And we will be getting some fresh snow there in Aspen for the start of the X Games today. At this point, tracking a cold front that is now racing through the state. Coming in from north to south, we're actually going to see some areas again of potentially some freezing fog this morning, especially north up near Longmont and Fort Collins. So you might still find some icy conditions this morning with snow then developing later today this afternoon. It's another chilly start. You're going to find a lot of cloud cover out there. Teens this morning and highs this afternoon will be anywhere from about 35 to near 38 degrees. So cooler today, not much in the way of sunshine and a chance for some snow this afternoon. We could pick up around one to two inches in and around Denver. Some of those heavier totals will be south along the Palmer Divide and west of town closer to the foothills.